What's up you guys? So I last left you off in the middle of that the woods and I told you that I'm gonna come over to this um, abandoned farm. Now I finally made it. I came over here. I did walk that entire trail by the way and nothing extra exciting happened so I just finished my walk and came over here. But this place when I was a kid used to be a running like dairy farm now i think it's abandoned i mean it looks like they might still use it for like certain things maybe just like storage and stuff but i want to try and find my way in now if it is still used for like storage and stuff they probably are pretty adamant about um locking the doors so i don't have my hopes up for this but this place was running when i was a kid so it's crazy to come around i never stopped here as a kid but i always drove by but it's crazy to come here as an adult and you see that it's no longer a thing like lancaster has grown so much and now i feel like i could probably get in trouble for being here it says no trespassing but I'm just gonna use the excuse that I'm making a YouTube video. Yeah, see, it looks like it's still being used for like storage and stuff. That scared me, not gonna lie. But I, I think it used to be Dairy Farm. This used to be, if I'm correct, That's what this would have been. Now, because there's a road back here and people have seen me, I'm just gonna walk around to the other side and try and find my way in. But I'm just really looking right now because it's cool. Um, it's sad that it no longer is being used. I don't know the reason for shutdown. I should probably look into that. Um, I want to climb one of those. Now one is shorter than the other, so I'll probably do the shorter one first and then do the larger one. But I'll probably only do that as at night as well because I don't need people seeing me up there during the middle of the day. But yeah, so I'm gonna sneak my way over here. I'm kind of upset that I didn't bring any light because I feel like it is gonna be dark in there if I get inside. Well, I could definitely climb those. I could definitely reach that. They take the bottom ladder down, I guess. So this is boarded up. But there's an electrical cable. So I'm inside. Now I know how to get inside. Um, the fact that there's an electrical cable makes me worry a little bit. I don't think that Hmm. How does this door work? It's locked on the inside. That's how it works. So I gotta get over there somehow. This one locks on the outside, so I was fine with that. Is there a door down here? I think I saw one. Let me know in the comments below if you guys would do this too. Trying to like not be seen, but I feel like that's impossible because 
of that road down there. But most people are oblivious to what's going on around them. So I don't necessarily... I just found my way in. Hold on. Now I do kind of have to worry if I hear sirens. I have to leave as quick as possible because my truck is on the property. But as long as nobody got suspicion while they were, while I was driving in. But I'm kind of glad I don't have my light right now. Because then people could probably see me from out there. It looks like they were trying to clean it up. Oh, is there a basement? So I'm ducking. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is just this door. Oh. I'm going to put that back. I think this is where they had. I'm still ducking. Oh yeah, look. definitely come here during the day or at night. All right, look at this, you guys. That's insane. That's fucking awesome. I can't believe I made it in here. Let me go over to this door that's open. I just couldn't see. So it's crazy to me. Anytime I get into these places, they're normally like not abandoned. Like, it's normally partially abandoned, I guess. Um, now I'm playing music. I just want to turn my light off. Uh, but now that I know how to get in here, I could come and spend a night in here if you guys would be interested in that. Okay. Oh, so I'm just gonna walk. I think that was the wind, I heard something. I guess I can't see nothing, I'm sorry. So I have to walk back out and around the list.
That's a tough one. Oh. Let's stop there again. Oh, okay, so I would have to. That one unlocks from the inside. So I would have to somehow make it so that it's locked when I leave. Can't do that. I feel like there's an upstairs to this place. I don't know why. I just do. Um, so I'm gonna try. As sneakily as possible. What about these doors? Okay, so this is why I couldn't open this door. It was locked like that. And this door, I possibly could have, uh, but I gotta get out through this thing. This is the coolest mechanism, you know. There's a little house you guys can't see. the noisiest thing. Like, if they were out here waiting for me, that would have gave me away. That would have been the thing. So there's this little room thing up. Okay, so there is a second floor. It's just kind of out in the open. The road's right there, so I don't know if I want to even try that now. Um, maybe I can find a way. I keep seeing things, though. Well, there's a lot of traffic coming. See anything in there. So I don't know what's on top of this, but that's about as tall as me. And I know that that ledge up there has an opening. That's a nice motorcycle. Yeah, I want to get in there. But I would have to go through there. And I can't really see. Oh. Okay, that's walkable. But getting up there is the problem. We'll see. Hold on. I think I know what I'm gonna do. There's a lot of cars coming, so I gotta wait. It was called Harvest Tour. It's getting pretty windy out. I think the next couple days here is supposed to be windy in PA. So I think it's coming through, but I'm gonna try and get up there. And then if I can't, I'm gonna head out if I can. If I can, uh, then I'm going to try and get in that little room. 
so this is the only way I can think of, but it's gonna be. That's scaring the shit out of me. Um, alright, so I'm gonna cut it here, try and find my way up there. If I can, I uh, will pick it up from there. If not, I'll give you guys an outro. One sec. Alright guys, so I made it up here, but I think I gotta do this quick. Because, I don't know if you can see all the way out there, there's a guy in a little, like, four-wheeler thing. Not four-wheeler, it's like a... I really hope this is safe. I want to go along the edge, though, because I feel like that's going to be my safest bet. But there's a lot of traffic. I think I'm just gonna run for it. But if I walk like straight out behind the silo, nobody's gonna see me, right? That's how that works. Okay, so this isn't really what I was thinking would be over here, but I'm gonna walk it. That's a bust, but I got up here, so I know if I ever need to hide. I can hide up here, because I don't think nobody's going to be able to come up here. It's a little sketchy, but it's okay. I do this for a living. But with that being said, you guys, I'm going to end it here. It doesn't look like there's much. Maybe one night I'll come back and try and get into the actual top of the barn, see what they got hiding up there. Uh, I don't want to stay here too long and have uh, suspicion, you know, but uh, hit that like button, subscribe. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy this adventure. Thank you for coming on it with me. Uh, get this to 100 likes, and I'll go back to the woods and here, middle of the night with the Ouija board, see what I can conjure up. Catch you on the next one.